Tell me more, tell me more, always thinking they're right. Tell me more, tell me more, we fell in love at first sight. Today was easy, like playing a game. We didn't hear girls complain. But we got bored, scratching our
turn the pages over to write what we want to write we've got to make ends meet before we get much older we're all someone's daughter we're all someone's son how long can we look at each other down the barrel of a gun you're the voice try and understand it make a noise and make it clear oh It's time, you know we all must stand together, with the power to be powerful, believe and we can make it better. We're all someone's daughter, we're all someone's son. Down the barrel of a gun You're the voice, try and understand it Make a noise and make it clear Oh, whoa We're not gonna sit in silence We're not gonna live in fear
To write what we want to write We've got to make ends meet Before we get much older We're all someone's daughter We're all someone's son How long can we look at each other Down the barrel of a gun You're the voice, try and understand it Make a noise and make it clear oh, whoa, whoa. We're not gonna sit in silence We're not gonna live in fear stand together with the power to be powerful believe in we can make it better we're all someone's daughter we're all someone's son how long can we live with each other Welcome to Green. My name is Chris Benison. I'm the show manager from Cast E 1999. Thanks for coming. <laughs> um, we have a tradition that we'd like to start off with, and that is the appreciation book. Uh, something that we like to pass it around to one another. We have this year, and um, Charlie's. Everyone, listen up, son. It's hot in here. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Karina, for passing this book on to me. It made me happy to know that out of all of the people that you could have chosen, you chose me. I want to thank you for all of your hard work this year. I want to, everyone to know that even, you even practiced when you went home for semester break. I also want to thank you for all of the short talks, laughs, smiles, bus dates, and for being my friend. Just one more thing. Yes, Yeville ha din kop. Now, now for the moment you all have been waiting for. Okay. This person touched my life in many different ways. On the bus during staging, she would help me with my addiction certain yellow moon-shaped fruit. She really made a big impact on my life somewhere back in Canada. Or maybe it was my arm she impacted. She even writes me the most beautiful poetry. Here's an excerpt. I know this boy, his name was Charlie. Stank so bad, he smelled like barley. <laughs> well, now I think she knows who she is, and I decided to write a poem for her. 
I once knew this girl, and her name was Nan. Rissa. The first time I met her, I thought she was a man. Roses are red, violets are blue. Someone smells. Is that you? <laughs> I love the fact that we can pick on each other, but I also want you to know that I think you're a wonderful person with a lot of drive and spunk. Even though we're not super close, I will cher cherish all of the little Marys I have of you. Also, I'm happy to call you my little sister. Thanks for all of the that you give, even when you don't know you're giving it. I have the, uh, the privilege of continuing with another tradition that we've had uh, throughout the year. This is certainly, uh, definitely a milestone <laughs> in our journey this year. And uh, I know many of you are still wearing the pin that we gave out in our very first green room, uh, where we started with a nice E bead and a green and a blue one representing the color groups that uh, we came from to form cast E. And tonight um, we have a gold bead um, as a ultimate celebration for the year and the, the journey that we have had together. So I will have these um, and I'll put them by the door or um, yeah, I'll do it that way so that you can have them when you leave tonight out of Green Room. Um, yeah. It's time I like to go into some last minute show notes. <laughs> Starting um, with Philippe. <laughs> coming through, coming through. Um, my big speech, uh, you will hear tonight at 1 o'clock by the truck, so make sure it's 1 o'clock. Okay. But for now, for the show, just rock the house, smile, have fun. Um, if there's any problems, I'm around. Okay. Can you steal my keys coming? <laughs> okay, so, uh, yeah, have fun. All right? Enjoy. Guys, um, yeah, I didn't think I was going to do a, a whole lot of crying today, but uh, I'll tell you, I was, we were standing in here about to get going, and uh, you guys were singing out there, and, whew, Wow, I can't believe what we've done. Uh, listening to the cast CD and listening to you guys just a couple minutes ago. Unbelievable, unbelievable. And you know, it, it's, it's incredible what we've done. And I'm very, very, very proud. And I can't wait to watch it one more time. I really don't have anything else to say other than uh, Winter medley people, make sure you preset your uh, your jackets and your hats and your scarves and all that lovely stuff that you're supposed to have ready. Um, there still could be, um, I had some last minute things come up, so there could be a couple of changes on the mic list, but those people that those are that that's affecting, you guys know who you are. So make sure that you check those again. Otherwise, have an awesome show and uh, give it. Show notes. Um, Dancer 2 and Aiko, watch your kick ball change kick. <laughs> <laughs> so keep, keep an eye on that. And um, just have a good time. <laughs> have a great show. Um, I'll be backstage for the first half, um, my last time backstage. And I look forward to seeing all you guys running around like crazy, having a great time, coming off, saying, thank God I'm never doing that again. And <laughs> some people in tears because they're not going to do it again. So, And then I'll be on Spotlight for the second time in four years. So. All right, have a great show, guys. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, yeah, Anara. Uh, <laughs> OK, so have 
an awesome, awesome show. Kick some hoo ha's out there. Um, look up to the spotlight for first half. Sasha will be doing it for the first half, so she'll be with you, but she'll be a little further away. So just keep your eyes on her as well as the audience. And then Jim will do the second half, and we don't really know about that yet. We'll see. And it's your last chance to get international costumes and flanks right. So I'm very excited. I'll see you out there. <laughs> Hmm. Shannon just whispered in my ear, do you know what you're going to say? And I said, no idea. <laughs> but the first word that comes to mind is family. I was looking at the, uh, the wall of right now, many different things, and the first thing that came to mind is right now we are family. <coughs> and that has been such a special feeling for a very long time. It has been an absolute honor and a joy for me to be your dance captain this year. To work for up with people is a dream come true for me. To have the opportunity to, to spend my life doing something so worthwhile with such wonderful people. I couldn't imagine anything better. And I knew that before I met you. <laughs> What an honor, definitely. Um, looking, looking ahead to this year, when, I, when we were back in staging in February, I was like, yes, I definitely had the energy, I definitely had the motivation to make an awesome year. And I had no idea that we could do what we did this year, that we could create the friendships that we have, that we could create the teamwork that, we'd, that we <coughs> excelled at so easily sometimes, it seems. The only thing I can say is thank you. Thank you so much. Have a great show tonight. That's hard to follow. Um. <laughs> you guys have no clue. How you touch this? Um. amazing how many wonderful people you can meet in this program and I truly cannot imagine meeting a more wonderful group than what we have here. It's almost scary to know that um, that I'm particular in going on because I will compare and it will be hard, hard, hard to beat all of the friends that I've made and the people that have, um, that will forever and ever be a part of my heart and my mind. And you all, I, I'm serious, I could pick out something in every one of you that makes me, has made me smile on a daily basis. Thank you for your patience um, and for teaching me patience, which was a very hard lesson for me to learn and know that I have, that you have taught me what I need to know to do another year and that you will be in my heart oh, for a really long time. Thank you for what you've given me this year and I love you guys. I will miss you tremendously. Well, I don't have a speech or anything, but have an awesome show and <coughs> celebrate those good times and enjoy it. Have fun. <laughs> have a good show. <laughs> something else? <laughs>
Um, yeah. yeah. Before I get started uh, with some of my shows, I first would like to take a minute to um, just say a few words about um, a group of people that I really, truly appreciate and have grown to love this year. Um, and that's the Performing Arts staff. Um, we, one of our first Performing Arts meeting and staging, we came up with this acronym, acronym PUF, P-U-F. Um, that stands for Professional United Fun. And that's what we narrowed down our list of about 30 or 40 um, descriptions or ideas that we wanted to be this year. Um, for ourselves and for you, and it, we narrowed it down to professional, united, fun, puff. <clears throat> so we took a few puffs from time and again, you know, um, to get us through some of the hard times. Um, but I, I think, speaking on, on behalf of Philippe and myself, I just want to really, <coughs> really appreciate these guys uh, for what they've done, the extra hours, the hard work, the sweat, the uh, the blue fingers from the show list, the you know the the bloody knuckles from the, from the risers, um, everything, the whole whole kit and caboodle, the whole package, um, and so just a small token from us. Had to light them on fire. <laughs> 